following is a presentation of antenna systems and solutions and our cell phone jammers. Here you will see a brief description and a short demonstration of our products. If you'd like to learn more about our jammers, you can visit us on the web at www.antennasystems.com or you can give us a call at 847-584-1000. In the latest issue of Time Out Chicago Magazine, Minding Your Manners takes center stage, and one of the big issues addressed is cell phone etiquette, or the lack of it. Our Christian Farr tried to find out if there are any rules, and he tells us there's more than one way to silence those loud and often obnoxious cell phone talkers. Cell phones are kind of magical. They keep us connected almost anywhere we go. But the convenience of cell phones can make it very inconvenient when someone decides to use one in a place that can really upset the people around. Just as the Israelites wandered through the valley in search of bountiful pastures. Ah! Hey, man. Nah, I can talk. Why do you think that happens? Why do you think people go into a sort of a zone? Um. I don't know. I think it's part of society today. I think there's so many people that are just concerned about themselves see themselves as a part of a larger community or society and don't don't realize how this is kind of infringing on other people's personal space. This is pretty big, kind of looks like a mini refrigerator. <laughs> it sure is. Actually, it does have a cooling unit right over here. Michael Tadros uh, runs Schomburg-based Antenna Systems and Solutions Incorporated, which produces a variety of what are called cell phone jammers. Right now, on my cell phone, so I can't make a cell phone call out of this room. That's correct. Okay, so test this right now. And well, as you can see, uh, we have a flat baseline, and as soon as we turn on our jammer, we'll uh, notice a lot of noise going on the spectrum. And within a minute or so, you should send a signal to your telephone. Okay. So, so because of that being on right now, I don't have any cell. No reception at all. But Tadros's company doesn't sell to the general public, only law enforcement, the military, and various government agencies. That's because cell phone jammers are illegal in the U.S. You get hit with a pretty hefty fine if you are caught using this and you're not authorized to. That's correct. It's $11,000 per day. But that hasn't stopped other companies, especially those located overseas, from selling them in the United States. Tadros constantly gets calls from people in the private sector hoping to buy one of his jammers. Restaurants, uh, movie theaters, hotels, um, and uh, believe it or not, tanning salons have called. Tanning salons have called? Tanning salons. Why would a tanning salon need a cell phone jammer? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, from what we understand, people go to tanning salons to relax, and they get upset when they hear a ring. Hello? Hey. While we wait for cell phone etiquette to catch up with the popularity of the cell phone itself, victims of those babblers can get a little solace from the way Darth Vader handles this kind of annoyance. <laughs> for Chicago Tonight, I'm Christian Fall. Thank you for watching our WTTW Channel 11 segment. If you'd like to learn more about our jammers, you can visit us on the web at www.antennasystems.com or you can give us a call at 847-584-1000.